Greetings to all. Our today's topic is Unit 2 Aquastics. The branch of physics which deals with generation, reception, propagation and analysis of sound is called Aquastics. The, sound, the study of sound waves plays an important role in many engineering and non-engineering applications. They are divided into architectural acoustics, that is study of sound waves in closed halls and buildings, musical acoustics, physics of musical instruments. They are also used in engineering field as engineering acoustics, technology of sound production and recording, study of vibration of solids and their control as well as noise control. Bioacoustics or medical acoustics are the sound in medical diagnosis and therapy. Classification of sound. Sound waves are classified into three types based on their frequencies. Number one, infrasonics or inaudible. Sound waves of frequencies below 20 hertz are called infrasonics. They are not audible to the human ear. Number two, audible sound. Sound waves of frequencies between 20 hertz and 20,000 hertz are called audible sound. They are audible to human ears. Number 3. Ultrasonics. Sound waves of frequencies above 20,000 hertz are called ultrasonics. They are also not audible to the human ear. Audible sound is further classified into musical sound and noise. Musical sound produces a pleasing effect to the ear. Example, sounds produced by musical instruments like sitar, violin and piano. Properties of musical sound are the waveform of musical sound has a regular shape. Musical sound has definite periodicity. There is no sudden change in amplitude. Next is noise. Any unpleasant sound to our ears is called noise. Noise causes irritation and strain to our ear. Noise of high intensity may cause permanent or temporary deafness. Example, movement of furniture, road traffic, explosion of bombs, etc. Some of the properties of noise are the waveform of noise is irregular in shape. It lacks periodicity. It also undergoes sudden change in amplitude and frequency. Characteristics of musical sound. The different musical sounds are distinguished from each other by the following three characteristics. Pitch or frequency, quality or timbre, intensity or loudness. Pitch is the characteristic of a sound which distinguishes between a shrill sound and a grave sound. Pitch depends directly on the frequency of the sound wave. For example, a voice of women and children has high pitch because the frequency of sound is high. The voice of an old man has low pitch because the frequency of sound is low. Next one is quality. Quality or timbre of the sound wave is a characteristic which enables us to distinguish between musical notes emitted by different instruments or voices even though they have the same pitch and loudness. Intensity of sound. It is the energy of sound wave crossing per unit time through unit area at right angles to the direction of propagation. Intensity I is given by P by A. That is power by area normal to the propagation of sound. Loudness. It is defined as the degree of sensation produced on the ear. It varies from one listener to another listener. Loudness is different from intensity of sound. Weber-Fenner law. According to Weber-Fenner law, the loudness of sound varies with the intensity of sound. The law states that the loudness L produced is directly proportional to the logarithm of intensity. It is given by L is directly proportional to log I. Sound intensity level. It is the ratio of intensity of sound 
to the standard intensity of sound absorption coefficient it is given by sound energy absorbed by the surface to the total sound energy incident on the surface reverberation time it is the time taken by the sound to fall to 1 millionth of its original intensity after the source of sound is stopped thank you